such a pain I felt as I bit into that ice cream pie in the heat of last July. Ooh, I had never felt such pain shoot from my tooth up to my brain. And I had three weeks left in the Spain. Oh, God, would I be forced to face my fear that I avoided year to year, the man I wished would disappear. The situation ranked a 10 in gravity. I could not fathom more depravity than fiddling with my oral cavity. I hated the dentist I always had, hated the dentist I always would, hate the dentist and I'll never change my mind. And even though the dentist in Madrid looked like George Clooney, I still really hated him because he had a drill. I heard this fear of mine could be genetic, and Carlos then was apathetic, injecting me with anesthetic. I watched my enemy grow more perplexed, had my puking left him vexed, cause that was nothing the drill was next. I thought, Oh God, okay, don't panic, don't shit your pants like you did last time when the dentist's wife was a journalist and sang Diego and sprinted all over the papers and it was so totally embarrassing that I will never show my face in California again. Somehow I knew my mouth was fully numb, but worse than pain it was the hum that made me not want to succumb. I knew this chair was just a booby trap. It even had a safety strap. Something hurt me. Holy crap! My mouth wasn't frozen. I never thought it was frozen. I never would think it was frozen. So I attacked Carlos the dentist and tied him to his chair. And then I realized he's hot. So hot that the hotness was the melt of the anesthetic that once closed my mouth. So I ripped his shirt off and he liked it. So I tried to kiss him, but my mouth was still frozen, which made it kind of difficult because all I could do was drool. But he still told Consuela, his secretary, to cancel his appointments so we can make love for the rest of the day. I'm in the love and to heighten the cliche. Wednesday was our wedding day on the coast of Biscay Bay. Now I've swapped the Bentley for the borough. Chocolate for the churro, and my teeth look like.